How's it going everybody? It's Tweedledy Dumb here and I'm back with another Bloodborne video and today we're going to be talking about the League Covenant which has arrived in today's new Bloodborne update. Now the master of the League, Valter, has given all the members of the League one mission and that is to crush all the vermin. The first vermin you crush gives you the League staff which is similar to the Vile Blood Register in telling you the roster of all the members of the Covenant and it also gives you the new gesture, the League Oath, which you have been seeing in the beginning of the video. The second vermin you crush will only change Walter's dialogue. It won't do much. And the third vermin you crush will have Walter say goodbye in a sense, saying that his time is done. The fourth one that you achieve actually, when you return to the you know windmill house, he's not going to be there, but there will be an item and he will drop the master's iron helm. The Master's Iron Helm is exactly like the helm that you get for defeating Valter if you choose to fight him. It has the same stats and the same look. The only difference is the name and the description. So you don't want to get these two confused. The description for the Master's Iron Helm. An Iron Helm resembling an upside down bucket. A single hole allows one to peek out with a single eye, which is probably all that its original owner had. The Iron Helm is passed down among Masters of the League. Walter had in fact lost the ability to see vermin long ago. Now the next one, which is not the Master's Iron Helm, it is known as the One-Eyed Iron Helm. Its description is an Iron Helm resembling an upside down bucket. A single hole allows one to peek out with a single eye, which is probably all that its original owner had. So it's basically the same description as the Master's Iron Helm, except it does not have that little bit of extra text talking about Valter unable to see vermin and how this bucket is passed on from Master of the League to Master of the League. Now, if you do crush the fourth vermin you find, your action, the League Oath, will change. It will go from you lifting your cane to you lifting your cane and putting your left arm or hand over your heart. So I'm pretty sure this symbolizes you now being the master of the league. And I'm not sure that this league or quest line will cover or go on any further, but I'm really looking forward to seeing what will happen in the DLC because there's going to be tons of content in, him, in there. Not only that, this update itself had tons of content added, there's new tools, this new covenant, it's amazing and I'm really excited and hyped for the DLC coming on the 24th. So I'll see you guys in my next video and have a good day.